He's, he's absolutely awesome. I mean, you know, you couldn't, you could not ask for anybody to be any different that could be better than he is. He's just, he, he's incredible. I mean, there's nothing that I, I could tell him that, you know what, Neil, I want to take and make this car fly and put a flux capacitor on it. He'd be like, let's do it. You know, that's <laughs> car of the future. Right here. Here and now. Here and now. Here, here and now. now. And it's smiling at us. Yeah, look at it. It's smiling. Hey, you tell him, hey, we love you too. Yeah, he had uh, seen the uh, MTV Pimp My Ride build that I'd done and was interested in doing a biodiesel conversion on this 59 Lincoln. And we started talking more and through the course of probably 60 days, we'd done a bunch of emails back and forth and I was just telling him what was going on and I mentioned this electric H3 I was doing and he just, he just you, could, you could almost uh, see his <clears throat> eyebrows raised through the email. He's like, oh, that would be so cool. Typically, if you, if you charge something and they get hot or if you yeah. run a generator they get hot but these little suckers don't get hot I'm liking them better all the time originally we we're gonna do it the Dormax diesel so he can run on biodiesel then we we transformed that into uh, an electric hybrid it's like we run over a cat or something <laughs> we immediately turned it into what we call a, a series hybrid which now you have a generator that powers the batteries that power the electric motor, kind of like a train. The train's one of the most efficient vehicles in the world. It's like 435 miles to gallon. He's Neil's manager as well as mine. It's like, you gotta have some of this. And so I got all these big CDs and I, I haven't listened to any of them, but <laughs> I've got them all. <laughs> I will break down. I'm sure, you know, I'm going to spend a lot of road time with Neil uh, as we go to Detroit and cross California. So I'm, go I'm sure I'll get to hear all the songs straight from his mouth. <laughs> That's a lot of road time.